Okay, Suffer the Night. New horror game. Very scary. I must have dozed off. Jeez, the storm is really picking up. Holy shit, this room is huge. Dude, I this... should check the radio for an update on the storm. This room is so sick. I open up the windows? <gasps> okay. Let's go. Oh, there's the radio. Oh wait, that's a camera. Oh, sick, dude. Look at me go. This is me speed running. Look. Okay, enter. Oh no, I hope the game doesn't have a lot to do with that computer. Yeah, where's, the okay, there's this elusive radio. I don't like that sound. This is an emergency broadcast. This is not a test. The county of Sleepy Woods Mountains has issued a Sleepy Woods Mountains. Thank you, Yuso, for the prime. Mr. Nibbles. Yo, Zeflin. <laughs> uh, okay. I'm really hungry. Some eggs and toast sound good. The fuck and is some coffee to wake me up. Yeah. No. No, I haven't dr driven all the way to Summerside to see it yet. I wish. Holy shit. I like that one. I'd have that in my house. This house is massive though, like the ceiling. Oh, maybe I'm crazy. I don't know. Very spacious. Yeah, I can't wait for the movie theater to open back up. I miss the Mario movie and Evil Dead. Oh yeah, Don.
Let's fill it with life. Here, I gotta go get my instrument. One sec. What? You can't hear it from over here. Oh, nice. Cool, Captain. I'm liking it so far. Yeah, we're going to keep that on. It's probably going to short circuit soon. Stacy, the house is massive. It is absolutely pouring. good on let's make our coffee I know how to do this. What are we making? No island in the kitchen. Where's that coffee? Nut spread. Coffee? Basement. What time is it? Almost one. Okay, where's this coffee at? Uh, we get some pop. We got some boom tarts, sorry. Maybe they keep it in the fridge like freaks. You know. Actually, I don't know why I said freaks. I keep mine. Well, it depends. Sometimes I keep my coffee in the freezer, actually. The egg should be done soon. Of course I did. I was in that video. It was awesome. Need to make some toast. Let's go, people. All right. Now, where are those coffee grounds? Holy crap, that was fast. Devoured.
Devoured. Thank you, Donzerto. Thank you, Sean. Thank you, Indominus. Oh, thank you, Fonzie. Thank you, Flash. Thank you so much, fellers. Coffee. <laughs> I don't know where it is. You in here? Coffee? Coffee? Cloudbark, where's the coffee? Left of the stove. Oh, there it is. Oh my god, dude. How much coffee you drink? Get it in bags. Holy shit. I was expecting like a little, little jar or something. Jeez, I have coffee every single day. Yesterday I woke up and I was like, um, I was ready for an awesome day and it was awesome. Yesterday was awesome. Um, I forgot to put some clothes in the wash down in the basement. And I thought to myself, I love Stacy already, by the way. I thought to myself, nothing can ruin this day. And I went and started my stream. And then when I went to get my coffee, I realized that um, the drain got plugged. So it just filled up to the brim. And then it overflowed all over my floor. And that wasn't epic, by the way. Thank you, Minidu. You should get a buff when you drink coffee. Like, you should get a speed buff in every game. Make it seem fun and, addic and addicting for kids. They already do it with sugar. Why not coffee? I mean, what's worse for you? Would you rather your kids... Okay, I got a, I got a question for you guys. I know the answer. Would you... Okay, let's say you have a 12-year-old kid. Would you rather them drink coffee every day or have sugary cereal every morning? The coffee has no sugar, by the way. It's just, uh, it's black coffee with a little bit of alternative milk. Correct if I'm wrong, but I believe, I believe the only, the main reason coffee can be bad for you is the sugar and the cream. So if you have, if you have coffee without sugar and cream, it's pretty much fine for you. Although black coffee can stain your teeth. But if you dilute it with something, it's fine. Holy shit! That was the front doorbell. Who would be here at this hour and in this storm? I don't know, but I don't care. Oh, look! It's like RE4! Watch this. The hell's hitting me? Oh, it's the crossbowman. It is RE4. Yeah. 
Leon? Holy shit, the mechanics! It's, we got a full-blown game here! Yeah, this guy's an asshole. Ah, yes, ta! Okay, we gotta answer the door. Thank you, Lunatip, for the five gifted subs. Thank you, and thank you, Sir Blacks, a lot uh, for the 48. And thank you, Shikamaru. And thank you, Genesis. Welcome to the not RE4 stream at the moment, guys. I'm playing this because I didn't have time to start an RE4 run before my sponsor. Shikamaru B. Who's at the door? I don't see anyone. When did this envelope get here? Okay, this looks like Death Note. Surprise. Who's Stacy? Oh shit. Oh no, it's A one of the floppy disk? Where did this come from? Oh no, it's one of There's these no games. One at the door. No, 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 no. No, you got People that recommended me this said this game is like an RE style game. If I sit at the computer like Welcome to a Game 2, I'm gonna lose my shit. Oh my god, this thing, this boom box is decked. A bunch of buttons that do probably next to nothing. That song is awesome. But I got an even better song. All right, pop her in. Your nightmare is just beginning. The twisted pendulum of fate now swings. You awaken on a cold, wet stone. The air is moist. A sickly sweet odor fills your nostrils. It's dark. You can barely make out your surroundings. Press one to get up. You slowly rise to your feet as you do a sharp sting. As you do. A sharp sting is felt throughout your skull and your vision blurs. Ah! Then refocuses. You're in some sort of cavern or cave. There doesn't seem to be any way forward. Look guys. I, I can... I can make it even more immersive. Other than a, there's no way forward other than a tiny gap between two enormous rocks. It's just wide enough to crawl through. I'm gonna search. Nothing was found. Okay, I'm gonna crawl through. You emerge from the crawl space into a large cave. It's almost pitch black. Well, let's search. Nothing was found. Climb up. You reach the top. An old metal torch hangs from the wall. Search. Nothing was found. You enter a large open mausoleum. A single dimly lit coffin sits at the center of the room. You open the coffin lid and are immediately overcome with nausea. The stench. His face and chest have been eaten down to the wiener by maggots. While searching the coffin and body, you notice an old key in one of his hands. I'll take that key.
Can I go forward? You turn the corner into another long. Oh! Dude, I don't want to look over my fucking shoulder, man. No, I like I love Welcome to the Game style games, but they're they're too fucking scary, dude. I'm not. I, I just want something to chill to do before I did my sponsor. No, I'm getting up. Anyone out there? Hard to tell. Oh my god. Thank you, Jimbo Timbers. And thank you, Curse. And thank you again, Lunatic, for the five good subs. Check the closet. Is there a closet? Thank god. Oh no. Oh good. See, that's the kind of bed I need where you, no one can hide under it. All right, let's go back. You turn the corner into another long hallway. Okay, we're gonna search. Okay, go forward. Search. You check inside the urn, expecting to find ash, but instead the light catches a glimmer of something shiny. An antique lighter. Ooh, okay. was that it sounded like an explosion all oh, the power just went out love Stacy Let's go. It looks like the transformer blew. Lightning must have struck it. I need to turn on the backup generator in the basement and reset the fuse box. forgot to refuel the generator the last time I cleaned it. There is some fuel out back in the boathouse. The boathouse. I should grab a flashlight from the garage before heading outside. Yeah, and I need my sweater too, probably. I think I left the key to the garage in the bathroom last time I took a shower. Let's go, people. must have blown. That light bulb is toast. Lavender mouthwash? What the? Now that's a sponge. Dude, this shower sucks! Holy shit! What the? Oh my god! I thought my shower was ass. It's like an old telephone. Um, thank you, Genormous. Thank you for the resub. And thank you, Dread. Yeah, that bath. Dude, what's with the Spider Man 
stuff on the in the bathroom. It's everywhere. This bathroom is way bigger than mine. Mine... My bathroom is like... I can't even like get it to where it would be as small as my bathroom. But my bathroom's hella small. Like e even if this was the bathroom, it's, it's b still bigger than mine. You'd move the- you'd have to move the... Toilet up here. And then... Then you'd have my bathroom. Hey, wait. I don't need to wear my jacket. Why am I here? Oh yeah, flashlight. Oh. I should head to the boathouse out back. There should be some fuel I can use for the generator there. Ah! But she can't stop headbanging. That's a safety hazard. Bow. Oh my god, he's so scary living out here. I would hate to live out in the country. I don't think I'd ever want to live in the country. Even though you get properties that are like the size of a freaking small town. It's empty. I need to refill it. There is a fuel pump inside the boathouse. Hello? Mr. Duck! Thank you, Victor. Now I can refuel the backup generator. I should head back to the basement. Let's go. Alright, the first scare is definitely coming soon. I'm scared, guys. She, she's a confident woman, guys. Just because if you guys were in this situation, you'd be like, ah, I guess I'll head back to the... the b -b 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 the b -b 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 boathouse. Doesn't mean she's just like, I'm gonna head back to the Giga Chad boathouse. Fuck it, dude. She ain't scared of shit. Look, watch, she's gonna be like. Now I need to reset the circuit breaker, and that should restore the power. See, look. The power should be working now. 
I should head upstairs and call in the busted transformer. Not scared at all. Look. Look at us. We're heroes, basically. Wait, head upstairs. Hello? Dude, where's the phone? What? There's no signal. The line is dead. What? Did the storm knock out the phone lines as well? No, double check, double check. The doorbell again. What the <laughs> hell is going on here? Yeah, she's getting a little shaky. Someone playing a trick on me. Who's there? Oh shit. Bro, I don't want what you're selling. I don't know if I should answer. Hello? Who's there? Hello, young lady. My vehicle broke down on the road a ways back. May I perhaps come inside and use your phone? What are you doing all the way out here? Are you the one who put the floppy disk through my mail slot? Floppy disk? I'm sure I don't know what you're talking about. You know, for a guy like this, like it's, do I let him in or do I not let him in? Like, here's the thing. You know, it's actually a hard decision. So let's say we don't let him in. Well, I mean, he's just going to break the window and be angrier and get in anyway. So would you let him in or would you let him just break in aggressively? That's the question. I mean, he's okay. Okay, no, you can't come in. And he's like, oh yeah, well, how about I just come in? And th then you're at, like, then there's no way. Like, at least if you let him in, he might think you're gullible, and then you could you could turn it on him. You could you could trick him. But see, if you don't let him in, then he instantly breaks in. He doesn't have to keep up the act. He could he just can start murdering you instantly because there's no. You know. Thank you, Mitt. I've thought about this. Well, of course. You didn't answer my first question. What are you doing all the way out here? Well, you see, I have family up north. It seems yours is the only house I could find off the road. Well, I'm sorry, but the phone lines seem to be down in my area because of the storm. Oh, really? The phone lines are dead, you say? Well, perhaps I can come in to dry off and get out of this storm? <laughs> I'm not in the business of letting strangers into my home. I'm sorry, but you can't come in. Very well, Stacy. I'll See? find my own way in. <laughs> I, told, I told you guys. I told you guys. What'd I say? Now he's pissed. Now he's gonna find his own way in. It's probably gonna be this freaking window here. I told you guys, look. You know, we could have avoided this whole fucking- What the hell is going on? How did that creep know my name? I told you- I told you guys! God, I thought the phone lines were dead. Is this a cell phone? Where the hell is this thing? Pro probably upstairs. I think he's in the house. I told you guys! All right, Cloud Bark, is this where the game gets really good? You're still here? Hello? Is anyone there? I need help. 
It's him. Hello, Stacy. Oh, fuck. You sick fuck, why are you doing this? I want you to finish my game, Stacy. I'll make you a deal. If you finish the game, I might just leave you alone. Okay, okay, okay. I'm not playing your stupid game, you bastard. I'm warning you. Leave me alone. No, just play the game. I, I have a gun. I know you're lying, Stacy. Now finish the game, or I'll come in there and skin you alive. Okay, well, I think I'll skip. I'll, 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 I think I'll finish the game. It's an easy. Uh, all right, let me in. Okay, so. I hate this look over the shoulder bullshit. I hate that shit. I hate my least favorite part of Welcome to the Game. Welcome to the Game 2, no complaints. Welcome, well, well, it's, it's, well, I think Welcome to the Game and Welcome to the Game 2 are two of the top 10 scariest games ever made. Let's just combine them into one and say they're in the top 10 scariest games ever made. But the reason for that, it's not that there's cheap jump scares. It's just that when there is a situation in a game where you are risking to see, like this, like this exactly, where you're risking to see a jump scare and you do this like 20 times and nothing happens. And then there's one time where it's the frame you press the button, the bad guy grabs the camera and screams in it. It's like the scariest fucking thing ever in a game. Anyway, with that being said, um, I'm gonna use the bathroom and refill my coffee because it is that time of the day, one moment. Dead. All right, let's use the computer. Okay, using the lighter, a large stairway is illuminated in front of you. We're gonna search. Thank you, Bratwurst. Thank you, Mitt. And thank you, Rambo. That reminds me of the Beasties trailer. Thank you, Victor. Thank you, Johnny. Thank you, Michael. Oh my god, the resubs right now. Yo, Peta. All right, all right, let's do this. Using the lighter, you reach the top of the stairway. The light is dim, but you can make out the path that continues to the right. All right, go right. No, wait, search. Okay, go right. You enter a spacious room with a large wooden table at its center. On the table sits a small lockbox. Chains surround the box and feed into a skull. Its locking mechanism is located in the mouth of the skull. 
search. Nothing. Okay, so... Um, let's go right. You approach the path to the right in front of you is another set of double doors. Well, let's just go forward. Uh... He's crawling on the ceiling, fellas. This sucks, dude. I'm not looking behind myself anymore. I hate this. <sighs> okay. You knock one over as you walk and ass is kicked up into the air. Is this actually your game, Michael? Shit, dude. Thank you so much for the 500 bits. The voice actress is in chat too for Stacy. Or was. Thank you. Thank you, M. Ishi. Thank you, Michael, for the resub. And thank you, Tito. Oh my god. Well, thanks, Michael, but I fucking hate your game. <laughs> I'm just kidding. It's scary, though. Uh, continuing down the dark hallway, you stumble across a monstrous sight. The corpse of a man hangs from the wall, shackled to some kind of torture device. God, I wish that was me. The machine has rotating gears that have ground the lower half of his body into pulp. Ah! Oh. The sight of it makes your blood run cold. Something protrudes from the man's abdomen. Well, let's search. Squish. We got the key. All right, I'll take it. You reach the end of the hall. Look behind you, he says. One second. No, I hate these fu I hate when games do this like uh, like like this like i'm i'm this i'm this i'm this i'm this look i'm the girl on the keyboard see and and it's like oh i'm this guys we're all this so i hate it god i hate the look over the shoulder thing it's welcome okay this is why it is let me tell you it's because what well, one's in the chat if you've never played welcome to the game One's in the chat if you've never, never played or watched. Welcome to the game. Okay. It actually traumatized me. It actually did. It's so scary that it traumatized me. I believe it did. I believe it truly traumatized me. Because, like, when you die in Welcome to the Game 1... It's, 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 so you're on the computer and they just fucking whip you around and insta kill you and it's a loud sound and it's fucking terrifying. I love Welcome to the Game though, but it's just, it's like, it's, it's a kind of game that's so scary, it's hard to even play. Because not only is it scary, it's hard as living hell. It's like one of the hardest games ever. Um, you reach the end of the hallway. Oh, I used to play Welcome to the Game 1 and 2 all the time. Sorry, I'll play, I'll play. I'll play. I'll play. You reach the end of the hallway. You find a large window. Iron bars cover the window, allowing no escape. You peer out, hoping to find some signs of life, but see nothing except for the moon. The path continues. After turning the corner, you come to a dead end. An enormous brazier sits between two pillars 
two metal rings rise from the top with wax candles attached all around. A gust blows past you, but its source is not apparent. A crawl space, eh? Are we going in? Well, let's go! That was glass breaking. Did he get in? It sounded like it came from downstairs. Dude, what's that? Dude, turn the TV off down there. Michael? Michael? This maniac is toying with me. I have to board up this window. There's a hammer and some wood planks in the garage. Board up the window, bro! If that man wanted in here, we gotta finish the game. While we're down, this is gonna break that window. Okay, this is not the garage. I just drifted down here for no reason. Is my laundry done? No, not yet. Sorry, I wanted some dopamine, and my laundry being done <laughs> would have given some. Okay. Get out of here, you fuck. He's basically just the Babadook. Wait, where the hell are the hammer and nails? Oh. these windows if I had enough planks. I can only hope that he won't break in if I keep playing his game. This is gonna be me with Michael one day. Michael's gonna show up with the sequel to my front door. You exit the crawl space and enter a chamber. A small table is to your right. On it are tiny candles and what look like human bones. I like bones. Search. You spot some rope amidst the clutter. Rope was added to your inventory. When I ask for rope, I expect to get rope. A flat wooden bed. Wait, we should go back. Wait. Wait, where was that chest? I don't know. It's not here. A...
A flat wooden bed is located inside a, the gated room. Raw sewage. Going down. You lower the rope until you're at the drain's base. I'm gonna take a pic. What the fuck was that? Oh shit! This broski needs to lay off. <sighs> A body floating in the sewage, okay. Approaching the corpse with caution, you push it to roll it over. As you do, it springs to life with a blood-curling shriek. It charges at you, slashing with claw-like fingernails. Okay. Going up. Yeah. Brother man. Should I run? Let me play my let me just let me just finish the fucking game, dude. The bastard tore straight through the wall and dresser while I was downstairs. Whatever it is, it's not human. Sign the book. What book? Broski, what book? The lighter illuminates your surroundings. Impulsive odor. The roof has a hole. Let's go. Oh, you reach the guardrail. As you get closer to the well, you examine the water and notice a spherical object. I'm grabbing it. We got the strange orb. Hogs. my mind 
Did you see that shit, dude? I want one of these, but Muck from Pokemon Gen 1. Like, I want a ma- If I had my way, I want a massive Muck. Wait, this corner. Like, that takes up the whole- Like, it reaches the ceiling almost. Like, just- Like- Fuck. This guy needs to stop fucking with me. All right. I'm going forward. Nothing was found. <laughs> Bruh! I don't know how much more of this I can take. What book? Sign the book. Where? Okay, let's go find this fucking book, dude. It's probably not even here, but... Where's that book? I don't have a book. Dude, something tells me we're gonna get pulled into the game or something. This reminds me of a movie called, um... Who's the guy from the Goonies? That... Actually had a career afterwards? The young one? Corey Fe wait, is it Wait, is it Page Master? Corey Feldman, yeah. Corey Feldman... Oh wait, I guess Sean Aston also had one too. And now the... Yeah, okay, and everyone had one now. Anyways, whatever, you guys got it right first guess. Cor Corey Feldman, what, what was the one with Corey Feldman? Oh no, it wasn't Corey Feldman, it's the guy who plays... Sorry, I got my wi my wires crossed. It's the guy who plays uh, sh uh, Don Connor in, um, in Terminator 2. What horror movie was he in? Yeah, Edward, Edward Furlong. Yeah, he was in a horror movie. It reminds me. Yeah, Brain Scan. Brain Scan. This reminds me of Brain Scan. <laughs> sort of. Well, I'm, well, I'm guessing it's going to turn into Brain Scan. It might. It might turn into Brain Scan. Oops. Okay. What's it read? Blood is the bond. The blade is the key. Bobrowski, I cut myself. Thank you, Lucky's Rubber Ducky. Thank you, Rox. Thank you, Tucker. Thank you, Snoo Glifford. Thank you, Zig. Thank you, Stoke. Thank you, Tito. Thank you, fellas. You climb the stairs and arrive at the top. Locked by an iron gate. Yikers? Oh. Oh! the skull chest we're here we got the blade And you cut a gash in the palm of your left hand with the blade, squeezing the open wood to extend your hand over the basin. Yeah, yeah. Hell yeah, dude. You notice a narrow path has appeared. Okay, I'm going up. 
You enter a dark room. Dozens of lit candles are scattered all across the floor. Sign the book. It's him! Book flips open and you hear a jarring crack of bones as the head of the figure slowly rises. You freeze in horror. Ah! As... Thought he was at my door. Well, let me examine what it says. Okay, well, let's sign it. Stacy. All right. Uh, oh. What the hell? That looks like my house. gonna get up that sounded like it came from the attic I think that freaks inside hello as I think he's in the house get out of my attic okay and motivational music Thank you, Graham. Thank you, Vanquish. Let's go. painted himself, that freak. Stacy. Oh, I got him. I got him. I inspected the painting from behind. Think you, <laughs> think you can get me? a new game together uh oh and this is local streamer cloudmark's mm, favorite yeah, part it's pounding where am i how did i get here so the first half of the game was awesome ah uh, Wait, wait. Sorry, that was really unrealistic.
We're making a game together. Hello? What the hell is this place? We're saving it. Oh, we are saving it. <laughs> uh oh, guys, the game. So when horror games do this, it's a it's a gray flag. You know what I mean by that? Where they had a really solid idea that worked. And in the exact same game, they're switching up the formula drastically halfway through. What's that smell? It's disgusting. I'm excited. Something tells me it's going to turn to a hide and seek. Which is most Steam horror games. That's why I think that's how it's going to go. Jesus, I think I'm going to be sick. Use the scanner to interact with hidden objects and pathways. Okay. Broski? Error inside object. The new pat? I'm down patching. Oh no. Exit the scanner search mode. Okay. Now here's the welcome to the game 2 aspect where it's like insanely... Uh... <laughs> Wait, how do I do that? How do I put the disc in? E. E, 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 Yo, Andy. Thank you for the two months. I'm going to be playing Evil Dead later as a sponsored stream. Check it out the Game of the Year edition. Wait, I'm pressing E. I didn't even get to play the, uh, the Battle Royale thing yet. E. Is it not working? Is it glitched? Oh shit. Okay. Thank you, son, brother. Thank you, Graham. What's that smell? Really, Failmore? It's disgusting. Uh, Jesus. I think I'm going to be sick. Beep boop. Catching. Thank you, Mr. Long Name. And thank you, Leon. Okay, exit the scanner search mode and enter read mode. Okay, so press E. Read mode. I've been dragged into this game. If you die here, your soul is doomed to decay inside these discs. Look at my thumb. Your bodies are taken and used in bizarre and morbid ways. One of the few items that can help is a strange machine. It brings back the things he took away. Write this down. Things that can help. Write this down. I'm not sure who made it or how. But it doesn't appear like he has control over it. 
Okay. Thank you, J43. I'm exiting read mode. Oh, I'll take that. Thank you. Nice looking key. He's packing too. Son of a bitch, you lied to me. I finished your game. You said you would leave me alone. Oh, Stacy. The devil's in the details. I said I would leave you alone if you finish my game. But I didn't say which game. <laughs> you bastard. You signed the book. You belong to me now. What sweet suffering I have in store for you. You bastard! Tell me how to get out of here now! You want to leave? <laughs> I don't think so. Goodbye for now! You bastard! Patching? Thank you, Box Baby Sue. Thank you. The fool. I'll take... Unintended jump scare. It's the lighter. <gasps> we're we're playing. We're in the game. We're in the game. The devil is in the details, people. Light this puppy up. Yeah, if, if I die in the game, I actually die in the game. No, don't say that I die in not the game, guys, please. Because then one of us is in deep trouble. I have a sponsor in an hour and a half, fellas. So, Fillmore, why didn't you read the floppy disks? The devs are reading chat, by the way. Oops. Yeah, they should have called them sloppy disks. Missed opportunity. Each version of this game begins similarly, but diverges greatly. Your rendition of his game tells the tale of his most recent victim. I discovered hints that the next iteration of the game was being written using my story. So many victims. So many stories. How many versions of the game came before me? Oh, I will, Michael. You underestimate my power. I'm just kidding, I probably won't, but we'll, we will finish it though. I love playing 
There, I've played so many games of people that have been subs or people in the chat. But it is bittersweet sometimes. I really like this game. Michael's one of the lucky ones. But I have played games for people in the chat that have <laughs> that. Well. Usually I, like, I don't, I don't really share much disdain for, uh, indie games because the, I find it mean. Depends. Depends. If the indie, if the indie game is like crazy expensive and it fucking sucks, you'll be hearing from me. But if it's like a $2 game and it's ass, I don't care. Um, but chat usually is pretty aggressive. And that isn't... Okay, let's... This is definitely... This is like, oh... This is telling me to go back. I, I don't think I should go this way. Or maybe I should. Oh, never mind. Oh, shit! That was a close one. Easy clap. Hello? Where are you going? Girl! Oh, hey. Oh, it's already lit. Oh, shit. Wait, how do I crawl? Oops. Oh! Hello? Oh yeah. Crawl into the creepy hole. God, what are you doing, Stacy? You know, Stacy's pretty cheery for someone that's getting destroyed. That sounds tasty. Broski, don't... We're in separate lanes, it's okay. Patching code? Oh my, wait, what? You can attack? Oh shit! I thought this was gonna be a fucking... I thought it was just gonna be an auto... or a walking sim. Yo, Alan. Welcome to the game. I won't leave any of you guys alone until you finish the game. What was he eating over here? Disgusting. Was that thing eating that corpse? And he wasn't sharing? With us? That's baloney. You still over here, bro? Oh, was it the painting? Yeah, we're gonna get aliens here in a second. No doubt about it. Okay, there's a doubt about it now. Oh wait, do we have to go back? Okay, we're getting aliens on the way back. Your descent into depravity is just beginning, Stacy. No! Why is he calling me Stacy? The name's Soup. The various remains of previous victims are all around you. Down here, nothing goes to waste. How much flesh will you obliterate in your quest for freedom? I, I don't know. Hopefully a lot. Oh hey, we gotta... We gotta turn something into mincemeat. 
Right, let's put some corpses in. Not bad. Some arms, some head. All right, let's go, people. Fill her up. Look at all that blood. That's how they make G fuel. Use code Bach. I think they offered me a sponsor a while back. Oops. Develop Michael. Michael? Today I embark on my game development journey. Michael! I decided to take the plunge and develop a game. I'm still figuring out the scope of the game, but I know I want to have advanced artificial intelligence. I've really enjoyed playing dungeon crawler games lately. I Maybe I can mix that in. Oh, I get it. He sounds... I think it's the same voice as the crazy man. Or that must be crazy man. Michael, are you crazy man? The lucky ones just die. Some of the people trapped here have had their bodies twisted and mutilated. Their minds are fractured and corrupted. What's no. left is a hollowed out slave who's oh. left to wander in this constantly shifting dungeon. To create new thralls, they seek fresh mead and new prey. I'd be a slave for some people. Oh, for Pete's sakes, dude. Hey, don't weird me. Britney Spears wrote a song like that. If you're weird me, you're weird the Spears, alright? I actually don't even know who wrote that song. All right, we're gonna sneak up behind him. We're gonna kill his ass. Oh wait, I guess we have to squish him. Squish him! Squish him! The magician. Oh, candles. Hatching. Uh, 
Bruh, come on. What the hell is that? Nice move. Very smooth. Now I'm just kidding, guys. I know we've all been in this situation before. This is Cloudmark's well, favorite puzzle. Well, I am impressed that you're still alive, Stacy. Thank you. Yeah, well, I ain't gonna die down here, you bastard. He's definitely an Orshalon fan. <laughs> now that's the spirit. I love the ones that put up a fight. It makes their suffering so much more delightful. I won't give up hope. I refuse to end up like the rest down here. Good, Stacy. Good. Speaking of hope, you've come this far. Perhaps a gift is in order. A weapon to help you along your way. Although, nothing is free. Oh, I thought he was giving the middle finger. Uh, please don't shoot when I press this button. Okay. You want- it's pointing up because it wants me to shoot the yellow things. Yeah, the broken butterfly. Let's go. Thank you, the Messiah. Thank you, Fat Furiel. Thank you, Blasphemous. Hell yeah. And thank you, Revo. Um, yeah, I'm excited to play Jedi. Um, and Breath of the Wild, Final Fantasy 16, and uh, Diablo 4. Those are the games I'm looking forward to the most. And all the horror games, obviously. I don't even keep... <laughs> okay, okay. Uh, so, focus, focus. Okay, so... Okay, so he's got a nice body. He's got big legs. Okay, he's... Look at us saving ammo. It is, it's the guy from the painting. Yeah, get out of here.
Uh, this is Cloudmark's favorite part. The Hermit. Oh, there's something over there. Ah! Get fucked! Got a free meal over here. Holy shit. I missed one of the cards though. Thanks. But I was looking for a card. Oh man, I can't wait for Dark and Darker as well. I feel like the, the unfortunate thing about Dark and Darker is it's gonna be the best and worst stream game. Best because if you're a massive streamer, it's great. Worst because every single person's gonna be playing it, so unless you're a massive streamer, it's <laughs> not gonna do well. Okay, one second. I need to check if I missed the card over here somewhere. Ah, it's too late. I am not a massive streamer. I'm a massive piece of shit. Oh! Oops. I'm afraid to click with the- with the rifle equipped. Hey! We know this. Do you have to torrent the playtest? That's sort of brutal. What did I get? Uh, let's go with Kenneth Gray 2. That freak with the knives for fingers has set up all kinds of puzzles down here just to toy with us. Yeah. It gives us just enough hope to carry on. I've tried to preserve, but I'm getting weaker and weaker. I don't want to end up like one of these creatures down here. There's <laughs> gotta be a way back to the real world, damn it! Damn it. Ada. This place is riddled with traps. I was almost sliced in half by one of them. All these traps have hidden switches that deactivate them. Mm -hmm. Use this device to reveal them. This device I have found seems to be something that was created to help us. Perhaps save us. I found more discs that seem to indicate that the maker of this device is the game's original creator. Michael. Perhaps as a result, the monster has no control over it. Oops. Ah! I've been sequestered for months in an effort to increase the size of my game. I was making a little progress, so I began searching for an alternative programming language. I dug and dug and found an obscure, esoteric language called Leviathan. Ooh. About it, not much is known, but from what I understand, its inventor, Dante Lamento, said its potential was endless. The only issue is that Dante disappeared without a trace Aquisha. not long after publishing the language. Oh, for God's sakes, I didn't mean to do that. I did read what it said, though. Skulls! <gasps> 
Hidden object found! Guys! What'd it do? What'd it do? Tell me! The sound effects remind me of a, another game we played. I can't remember what it's called. But I like the ambient track. Hey everybody, I'm here. Oh shh. Oh shh. Don't come any closer. I will shoot. I'm an RE4 remake speedrunner. That's why I can't hit anything. Oh, jeez, Louis, my dude. Come on. Thank you, Andrew. I like how I'm shooting the guys that are useless and I actually crowbarred the hard guy. That's genius. Like it's nothing? North, west, south, east. North, east, south, west. If I did this, oh. never mind. Hello, oh, this little piece of shit's back, isn't he? Congratulations, Stacy. You have completed the first trial of my game. Very few make it this far. Loud Mark and Failmore made it this far. Don't you have anything better to do than annoy me? How feisty. You know that device you found won't save you. I may not be able to stop you from using it. You know, guys, if I did voice acting in a game, imagine the chats, the chats playing the game. Oh, Taste who's this soy boy? Now, oh, fuck you. Go to hell, you freak. Yeah. Yeah. Freak. Uh. Where are we pointing? Oh, guess I'm taking it. Latu, Verata. Hog? Um, well, we didn't get that card, but that's okay. Saving it. I can do voice acting. And I will one day. I was actually asked to do a few horror games. Ooh. Through email. But I had to say no to all of them because it was just so much, it was so much work that they were asking and I just don't have time.
่ะโอ้ยชิดโอ้ here we go this is more my style <gasps> speaking of that I was in the Larksa game yeah oh man I can't wait for the new the Five Nights at Freddy's Security Breach DLC it's coming out this year you guys remember when I ran that game happening Gregory dude I I loved that game you didn't like it I legitimately loved Five Nights at Freddy's security breach please insert one token for admission onto the ride okay you accept bits of string Oops. Bruh. You can't be telling me you're looking back here. Oh. Any coinage? Gregory. You must get inside my stomach. Gregory. Please. Gregory. Gregory. Gregory? Where's this coin? Wait. Sorry, I struggle with the controls of this game deeply, if you can't tell. May I come in? The wall is glowy, but I could- I tried to press it. Oh, it's working. Going down, baby! Sorry, yeah, I seen the glowy wall, but I guess I was in a bad position and I just- Stopped. I thought it was glitch. There, there's a couple places in the game that have been glowy and they didn't do anything, so I was like, whatever. Take the coinage. Take the disc too. Is there anyone break dancing in the chat? All right, I'm gonna jump scare you guys. Are you ready? Ready? Thank you. But oh, we need the wings. Bella! Wait, we don't have the wings, brah! Broski! Wait. Let's- let's listen to the thing. God, you know, okay. Here's- 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 here's the issue with the controls. 
or not issue, but uh, it's that F is the action button in RE4. That's fine. But the fact that you can always press F no matter what you're doing and it doesn't, it, all it does is activate the lighter just poses immense problems. And you can't use the scroll wheel to go into search mode, so I keep doing that. See, see, I press F to go into read mode, and it's just... yeah. It, Michael, you need to... Michael! We need a patch! We need a patch! He will manipulate your thoughts against you, so be careful. He will use elements from your reality in the game he creates. He will use anything against you, be it an idea, a tangible thing, or something private to you. He gets more enjoyment from seeing you struggle. You must continue fighting. Don't let him win. Thank you, Kane Skill. Michael! Gregory! Where's the wings, though? Are they not down there? Okay, I gotta check again. One sec. It's unplayable. We need a patch. Oh, I'm playing. I'm doing the sponsor, by the way, with another streamer named Kriken. Have you guys ever watched him? Or Kriken? I don't know exactly how to pronounce his name. That's it. Yeah. Ow. Kriken. No, I love him. I'm going to tell him I love him. Next stop! Oh, roller coaster? Is this your idea of fun, you psycho? The sound may not be much, but the ride to the dive hole! <laughs> hey, by the way! Hope you like thrill rides! LEAN! Left turn! Corner to the right! Oh my god, it's the Bella sisters. Look! It's the Bella sisters, guys. Why is it? More ammo. <gasps> 12 gauge. God, we're gonna need a few patches, people. Michael, were you were you terrified that I was gonna play this? And you'd have to sit here and watch the memes unfold. Too many movies. Oh! <sighs> Michael! No. Uh, how's this? Ah, uh, it doesn't matter now.
Fucking idiots, dude. What do you expect with a freaking Michael AI crafted game? My god. Here we go again. Michael. Is this your first game or I can oh god I, I hope I didn't play another game of yours I can't remember shit I can't remember anything about anything I don't even know my brother's birthday okay Oh wait do I have to actually have to pull these Oh I thought these were just noob, noob levers, noob levers. Oh, for the love of fucking Pete, dude! It's your first published game? Oh, cool. All right, so we need to figure out the, okay. Uh, it goes pink to the blue, to the yellow, to the blue, to the, it goes pink to the blue, to the yellow, to the teal, to the, to the green. Pink to the blue, to the yellow, to the teal, to the green. Pink! To the blue! Michael! To the yellow! To the teal! Oh, is this teal or green? It's teal. To the teal, to the yellow, to the blue, to the green? Or are we on green now? To the teal, to the green. Yeah! Oh, shit, we forgot to check for stuff back there. Wait. Or do we care? Should I... Do we care or no? <sighs> my mom kept my first painting ever. Okay as a kid, and it looks exactly like this. Except it's not a red background, it's like just paper. But it was like a glow in the dark green. That, that was it, that's what it looks like. Are you the Bella sister? He's hiding his wiener. That's okay. That'll make enemies spawn. Start it back up. Does this hurt? I don't have the shotgun yet. I don't think it's going to be in this small box. Green. I finally found a simple program written in Leviathan. When compiled, it prints out a message from Dante Lamento. For those who seek answers to questions unanswered, problems unsolved, and pleasures unknown, my gift pleasures is unknown. Leviathan. 
will give you your heart's desire. This application contains a complete library of syntax library. that may be used once I have access to the source code. The source code. Hmm. The green disc was a buff? Thank you, Lost and Buka. Damage the battery while he's standing in the trap. Oh! Yeah! Get him, Skeeter! Get him, Skeeter! Get him, Skeeter! Maybe I'm supposed to go up and... Gregory! Oh, oh! There is a period where I can whack the, his balls off. One sec. Right, I'm gonna whack his balls off. Here we go. Get him, Skeeter! Wait, maybe I can overcharge it too. We got him! Michael. Michael. Ma Michael. Don't worry, it happens in every game I play. I really liked that one. I really enjoyed watching it die. Don't all be oh! I had a delayed reaction. You know what would be funny? By the way, I'm not saying this is true, but you know what would be funny, Michael? If this was- if- if Michael actually <laughs> wasn't even one of the devs, he just- he just played it off at first and then, like, just rolled with it for the rest of the stream. That'd be pretty funny. He's a dev, though. He's the dev. Thank you, Gyrox. Nice feet. Yeah. 
I designed this fun house just for you. Yay! There are so many tricks and treats for you to enjoy. Hurry along now, Stacy. I can't wait to see what you do next. So there's a little baka soup check it somewhere in the game, right? Where is he? Is, is he somewhere? Where'd you put him, Michael? Is he is he under here? Where'd you put him? Where where? Oh meat! Oh my God! You made meatsa? Yes, because you kept telling me to play that game, and I finally play. Act. You want to know something funny about meatsa? Here. I have to alt tab. It's gonna kill the. It's gonna kill the vibes. But you want to know something hilarious about Meatsaw? All right. There's a. I showed you guys this website many times. It's called Twitch Tracker. You can see all the details about your stream. Okay. I'm just gonna. This is funny, Michael. All right. You want to see which game did the best for me ever of any game on planet Earth? You ready? Michael will like this. So Michael kept telling me to play his game one day. I can't believe this was a year ago. Holy shit. But Michael kept being like, hey, play my game. You got to play my new game, Bach. And finally, I was like, all right, I'll play the fucking game. Holy shit. Um, and it was called Meatsa. Okay, check it out. Sort, sort by average viewers. Meatsa, number one game by average viewers. Sort by most followers made in an hour. Meatsa. But do you want to know why that happened? It was because I streamed it on my birthday and I got a huge raid or like two huge raids as I was playing it. The game was like 10 minutes long, but um, yeah, I got, I got huge raids while playing it and it's probably going to stay at the top of my average viewer account and follower account forever at this point. Yeah, they didn't raid me because it was my birthday. They raided because the game was fucking sick. All right, if I know Michael, which I do, watch this. I can figure this out in one try. Now, this is classic Michael. Watch this. It's classic Michael. Just watch. Told you guys. Classic. Play meat saw. Play meat saw. Play meat saw. also oh there's a car I'm like okay cool it on the back seating <laughs> I'm just kidding So this gives us the wings. Wait. Okay. Wait, did we did we find where to use this? Uh yet? This this card? Thank you, Gyrogs. Thank you, Tama. We didn't find where to put this yet, did we, Michael? I, I seen 8-Bit Ryan played this too. If you guys haven't seen the Xmas Rock YouTube, I did a collab with 8-Bit Ryan, another YouTuber. Um, if you haven't seen it, it's for RE4. Do, 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 do. Whoa, this is bumpy. Right turn! 
Left turn! Look! You can see where they dug up the bugs! Boards up ahead! Lean! Thank you, Dan, top tier. God, I can't wait to run more RE4. It's just, I, I couldn't today because of the sponsor. In half an hour, by the way. Uh, that's the that's one of the problems with run, the game taking like almost two hours. But let's not kid ourselves. It takes like it takes like an hour to get a run going, and then the run takes two. Uh, what the hell am I doing? I was gonna do something. Oh yeah. We missed one. Leviathan is proving to be the solution to all of my problems. I'm programming at an exponential rate. Sometimes when I'm working, it's almost as if my hands are possessed and are writing the code before I even think of it. My senses are heightened and I feel a rush of euphoria. I've never felt anything quite like it. I've begun writing a library of functions for the game. This library will appear as a book inside the game. The game's rules will be governed by this book, which will contain all of Leviathan's power. He was so this innocent will before. serve as the game's MacGuffin. In order MacGuffin. to finish the game, the player will need to acquire this book and its power. The game is no meat saw, but it'll do. Watch it, Stacy. You're not getting out of here if you don't pay attention. That nearly flattened me. Whoa, dude! I'm getting f f fucked. First death incoming. I gotta change that command, by the way. You bros good, or...? I gotta add brackets to the Evil Dead the game. It's... It then say Game of the Year edition, or G-O-T-Y edition. Sorry, I was expecting Code Veronica. Latin. Left turn! <gasps> Jesus! Oh, shit! Okay, listen, don't come any closer. Left turn. Yeah, GO2I Space Edition. Thank you, sir. Do, do, do. My priestess. Oh, we got the snake. Cake. Do -do. Oops. Okay. The book is finished, and now I've begun I'll programming try. artificial intelligence. In a dream, I had a thought. 
or should I say a vision of a bizarre pale man wearing a tall hat and having a face that was stretched in the most unnatural way. Ew. It just stared at me with this horrific look on its face. When I woke, I knew this image was perfect for my antagonist. Perfect. I have dubbed him Mr. Tops. My past experience with artificial intelligence has always been very basic and linear. But with Leviathan, I am able to expand and give life to Mr. Tops. Mr. Tops. Mr. Tops. Mr. Tops. Mr. Tops. Mr. Tops. Who are you calling Sancho? Uh, that game is awesome. I can't wait. Or well, um, I played the, uh, I played the demo. It was really fun. <gasps> Exo Primal comes out next month, doesn't it? Who want anyone, any Twitch streamers in the chat want any advice on how to kill their channel? <laughs> Exo Prime was coming to X Month. I'm just kidding. I'll be playing Exo Primal. It'll be good for a day, probably. I hope. It might not even be good for a day. But hopefully. called Twitch Tracker. You gotta do this all in one go. This is nuts. Rakir is just going above and beyond, but Mubot doesn't care. Good for a day. Well, here, let's use some... Ah, uh, I can't wait to see Evil Dead. Why I say that? I played Exo Primal Beta, okay? I was doing very well every match. And the viewers were very high at first. And it didn't even take two hours, and it just... It's the kind of game that people just want to see the shit show, and after they've seen it, that's it. That's enough. You could already tell by the beta that that game is dead on release, unfortunately. I don't like saying that, but... It's just, it is what it is. These things are very easy to see. D-O-A. Dead on arrival. I'll still play it. It looks fun. Um, but... We'll see. Left turn! Yeah, I hope- I do hope it ends up being a decent game. But we'll see. Hammer Smash Face. Hey, that's a Cannibal Corpse song, I think. Or, it's some death metal song. I think I missed one of the weapons. Health Disc. Oh, okay.
I don't like the sounds of that. Goof. Was this RE4? Okay, just checking. Save some ammo. I'll just tank it. New weapon? Man, I wonder where that shotgun was. Skater? Wait, can I just shoot him in the eyes? is called Left Turn. I'm just going to face tank it. Oh, it didn't work. Ah! Alright, I'm going to do this the intelligent way. Ready? Oh! 
Come on over, fuck boy! No, no, come back up, come back up. There we go. Ah! Hammer. Smack. Cleaner. Is he dead? He's not dead, Skeeter! Reload, quick! We got him! Oh shit, maybe let's look around. We killed Hammer Smash Face. Do, 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 do. <laughs> I'll take that. Oh, more pins! I have a riddle for you, Stacy. Okay, guys, you can backseat the riddle if you want to. What ticks like a clock is louder with more powder and is more messy than confetti. Ticks like a clock. A bomb! It's a bomb! <laughs> oh! <laughs> you fucking... Michael, please. Bah. Michael, come on, man. Bah. Michael Puzzles. Classic. What do we got? What do we got? What do we got? What do we got? All right, Sancho, you ready? Are you just like dancing like mad, Ophie? Right turn! Holy moly! Whoa! This is kind of fun! Left turn! Right turn! Alright, Sanchez. Okay, Sanchez, I, I have to do my sponsor now, I, I think. Let me just double check on the timing. But the sponsor's gonna be epic. 
Oh yeah, okay, right. Let me see. I am red. Dude, I don't know why. It's because of my clothes. My webcam sucks. Look, now I'm not red. Wait, watch, watch, wait. And now I'm not red. Look, I look normal now. Look. Sorry, I don't want to see. I don't want you guys to see my like ten foot bulge. Okay. Um. Back. Okay, I have to quit out of the game. Michael, it's been great, dude. I will finish. 